Alright, there's just more references with bombs and uh, and Abraham Lincoln assassination type uh, you see him standing up and you know, see how it looks like a an eagle America representing the eagle and Osama here bin, bin Laden you see where it separates this is supposed to be something behind him I guess but it looks like an eagle anyway Abraham Lincoln aircraft carrier the the Abraham Lincoln air craft carrier who's the principality of the air and whose craft is going to succeed for you know a period of time and what uh you know how there's like a you know like t-mobile is a carrier of the uh metro there's a you have a carrier it's like what company carries your phone lines the carrier is what you're looking at right now this is a carrier YouTube is a carrier it carries all of us right now and but see the Lincoln which is also representing Philadelphia is uh, it's also going to be everything's going to be tied in to this second thing going on here then you got bomb references as of today by that's right Mr. Mouthpiece so five hours ago today September 9th it's faster than the it's insane it's faster than the speed of sound and this thing is stealth. You don't see it coming. The United States uses it. The Israelis use it. And the Brit you don't see it coming. United States is use. You don't see it coming. United States is using it. British use it, and you don't see it coming. You don't know it's coming. Just boom. Well, Israel has dropped the bomb on Iranian troops. I repeat, Israel has bombed Iranian troops killing 18 Iranian troops in Syria. This is really going to intensify the, the tensions between uh, Israel, Iran, and everybody in the Middle East. So you got Lebanon shooting down Israeli drone and Israel bombing Iranian troops in Syria. Folks, we're going to get a song. September 6th. This one involving a bomb threat on the campus of Michigan State University. Someone reported a threat at or near the administration Hanna building on Auditorium Road. Now, we broke that story just moments ago with a push alert warning you about the scare. Michigan State Police also posting a warning on their Facebook page. It says, quote, we're asking you to evacuate administrative Hanna building immediately and report any unattended packages, suspicious activity, or persons to Michigan State University Police. Now, please tell us that building is still evacuated. All right, now, Israeli News Live, you know, they're all in on it. It's just a matter of who is telling you the kindest, you know. Like, he can tell you kindly. I can see that. But here's the, the, the reference. Uh, missing in action. So on September 6th, there's that guy, Adam Green, that Richie from Boston always references. And then um, just, you know, what do you think that is? I'll get to that in a second. But from a distance, right here, you know, that's all you got to look at is, hmm, what is that? What letter is that? But it's three, it's three uh, flags, you know. There's one there. There's two right there. And a third one behind that. But this one here, it just, it looks like it makes a, a letter. 
And um, and the flag also looks like a sports team. But listen to to the theme here. Uh, incriminating evidence here uh, of the links of all types that you could ever imagine from. Uh, I'll, I will let me let Adam know that uh, I I have, I'll just let him know real quick. Uh, call in. Five. I know a lot of people are worried about Adam Green, uh, concerned that whether you know for his safety because we from what we hear he's not posted in about six days. He just tried to call me now, so I believe Adam is okay. How many I will days? Call him in about six days. He just tried to call wait, me. Wait, wait, wait. So Slow that down. We, from what we hear, he's not posted in about six days. He just tried to call me now, so I believe Adam is okay. I will call him. All right. I've learned from experience when they hurry up their favorites really quick and they try to say something. Slow down afterwards. They slip in the code, which is six days. All right, it's just a six reference, no big deal. Just letting you know how they slip their words in. So what he's also doing is letting us know he's having a conference in Pennsylvania next week. And um, I'll show you how he slips that by too real quick. And then, you know, I, I mean, if you take a look, it has a, you know, it has a letter. It looks like a letter. These are some fun facts that you need to know about Philadelphia. He's going to Pennsylvania. Some more insights with you guys, maybe some clip ideas of things that I'll be sharing in Pennsylvania there, things that I'll be sharing in Pennsylvania there. So the way that they're trying to slide the words by are the ones that I pay attention to the most. So remember back on July 4th when uh, Johnny there was talking about the paint and Rapture Red Home Depot. And then watch how he just slips the word Home Depot and tries to just get it away from you so you don't remember what he said and he slows all the other words down. And it was Rapture Red. So he reached in and he picked out of, you know, all the paint samples at, at, at Home Depot. He reached out and he pulls one out. The first one that uh, um, I had and it was Rapture Red. So he reached in and he picked out of, you know, all the paint samples at, at, at Home Depot. He reached out and he pulls one out. And the first well, one we're also getting reports here into our newsroom um, that the active shooter situation <laughs> may have also uh, taken place at a Home Depot so, in Odessa. Do we know so um, so happen? there's a couple of different things no, going on. We don't know if they are related, idea. but that is also coming to us from the Midland Police. <laughs> so, do we know something's going to happen? No. Do we have kind of a hint e idea? Yeah, kind of. Yeah. <laughs> That's how they talk when they're trying to slip things by and then next thing you know it starts happening in the places that they've been talking about and yes they they will make sure that it's positioned the way it is that way this this little circle can be right there because he's letting you know that it's Philadelphia. He's letting you know it's he's coming to Pennsylvania. They, they, they can't straight up tell you exactly what they're doing, but they can you they can tell you through all types of sentences and beat around the bush. I'm just trying to put all the pieces that they put together to to put it in one area to let you know where it's going to happen at. So this is. I think, I don't know, I just seen it today and it reminded me just seeing that that pose right there. Because they like this they'll stop it on the spots that they want you to see too. So this is uh referring to um the eagle being plucked up and then made that but then made to stand up like a man, something like that. 
Not sure what this is about. Not sure yet, but it isn't random. Maybe besides letting you know that the battleship's going to get sunk. Like, it looks like a battleship, don't it? And then he, this this guy here. Uh, something's supposed to sink. Now, it's not the same thing, but the battleship, you know, the... the uh, Lincoln, the Abraham Lincoln, along with Abraham Lincoln, along with the money itself, and, uh, you know, there, she has like a fire right here, I know a fire just happened, like news-wise, a fire in Philadelphia just happened, and then, um, well, this thing here is, I don't, again, I'm not sure. Can they even get that back up on it? Right side up? Oh, wait a minute. Let me see a, a, a view there. Oh, with that view. Uh, I'm probably stretching it. Yeah, probably stretching. But the Philadelphia fire did happen. And, uh, yeah, whatever. Once that occurred, the Lord told me to look up the name Yoder and look at the city it comes from. And I'm like, oh, okay. Now, I'm sorry, going, maybe I'm over here. Okay, you wait, can I get everybody ready? <laughs> Brace yourselves. <laughs> so the city where the lumberyard is, is New Philadelphia. <laughs> Does that ring a bell like what's on that it? container out there? Revelation 3.10 There's a letter to the church of the angel of Philadelphia. Letter to the church the of the angel of Philadelphia. Jerusalem, to the I told church that's what that container of Philadelphia. So since their video, exactly 30 full days later, was uh, the final fourth event with Ned Peppers over there in uh, Dayton, Ohio, right where he was talking about getting the, the lumber at, and then the fire firefighters I remember click saying it's gonna be hot it's gonna be hot hot and get a burn and then here comes a fire at the church in Philadelphia so that was the second event out of the out of the the batch that was here in Philly and it's not, we're not done. We're not done here in Philly. Now pay attention Revelation to the numbers. Revelation 21 says, right? I said, well, Revelation 10, uh, 3 says. He said them, all three of them, purposely. Revelation 21 says, uh, said, I mean, uh, 10, uh, 3. He's telling you 10 is the month. 21 is the day. That's that's a, it's a wrap, and then he's telling you there's three days of darkness. I mean, I'm just telling you what he's saying through that. You want to listen to it again? Is the New Jerusalem the bride of Christ? Revelation 21 says, and I, I said, well, Revelation 10 uh, 3 says, and I will write upon you the name of the city of my God, which is the New Jerusalem, which comes down out of heaven. And then in Revelation 21, you find out, John says, And I saw the new Jerusalem coming down out of heaven, adorned as a bride. Okay, so these are all these coincidences going on with all this stuff. So now, the, the heaven, the tree of heaven table. These are all these coincidences that are just going on. It's crazy. With all this stuff. So now, the, the heaven, 
the tree of heaven table came from Yoder, which is in New Philadelphia, which means brotherly love. And uh, it's Yoder, and which it's means 514. Get ready, Philadelphia. Remember, back in August 10th, get ready, Philadelphia. And then four days later is August 14th, that Philadelphia shooting. And then 13 days later is the fire over in that church there. So they tell you all throughout their videos what they're getting ready to do next. It's weird. Is Where's the date of the upload? It doesn't have a date. Hey, Rob. But he wanted to show I you. I figured I'd make a video. And the threshold. Thank you ahead of time. You're welcome. You know, he wants you to see the threshold. I don't remember exactly what that one video was, when it was the last one, but other than that, it's a, it's a week ago. Yeah. I don't know, I mean, I, I'm going to have to say... I know what. It's been a it's been a week, right? Well, I mean, it's been like four. This is like the fourth day. But he did say that I made him rich. He did say that. So maybe he went on a vacation. Hey, Rob. I figured I'd make a video and thank you ahead of time. Do 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 do. I just want to thank you ahead of time. You know why? You know why? See, because you don't realize it yet, but you, Robin, you're going to make me, you're going to make me a rich man. What do you think about that? Well, enjoy your vacation, your vacation, Steve, because I know you're, I know you're coming back real soon, and as soon as you come back, all hell is going to break loose. Just coincidentally, of course.